There are hundreds of hours worth of videos uploaded to YouTube every second, but will we ever run out of videos to upload? Or a better way to phrase this question is, how many possible combinations of YouTube videos are there? To answer this question, we need to understand what a video is. A video is a series of pictures played really fast to give the illusion of motion. Each of these pictures are made out of a bunch of pixels, and each pixel is made up of red, green, and blue, each between a value of 0 through 255. So first we need to see how many combinations are in a pixel, which is 255 raised to the third power, or 16,777,216 combinations. There are 16 million combinations just for one pixel. Next is the resolution of the video. YouTube supports a wide resolution of videos from 144p to 4k. To find the number of combinations per frame, we would have to multiply 16 million by the number of pixels in a frame. After adding up all the combinations from all the resolutions, you would have 7.2 times 10 to the 59 millionth power for one frame. Now we would have to raise 7.2 times 10 to the 59 millionth power by the number of frames in a video. To find the number of frames in a video, you would have to multiply the frames per second by how long the video is in seconds. A YouTube video's frame rate can be from 16 to 60 frames per second and can have a maximum length of 12 hours or 432,000 seconds. Now since there are so many frames frame rates and possible YouTube links a YouTube video can have, I only use the highest frame rate and the longest video length. The reason for that is since we're already using the highest frame rate and the longest video length, using other lower frame rates or shorter video lengths would make no difference to the final answer since the final answer is already so big. After multiplying the highest frame rate, 60 frames per second, by the longest video length in seconds, 42,000 seconds, you would have 25 million possible frames in a YouTube video. Now we would take 7.2 times 10 to the 59th millionth power from earlier and raise it to the power of 25 million which gives us a total of 10 to the freaking what is that which gives us a total of 10 to the 154th trillionth possible videos now this number is just mind-boggling it has 154 trillion zeros it's just hard to compare this number to anything because nothing in the universe is just this big for example if every single combination of video was an atom in the universe we would have this many universes now an average youtube video is around 10 minutes which is around 100 megabytes with some math that would mean that storing all of these videos would take this many exabytes. Exabytes are 1000 petabytes. Now YouTube is very secret about how much storage their YouTube videos take up, but estimates are around 10 exabytes. Heck, the entire world is estimated to take around 295 exabytes in 2011. Now as impressive as this may seem, how many of these videos are actual videos? A lot of these videos are just going to be random pixels or just not good videos at all. Well to solve this problem, I'm going to be using Fermi estimation. Fermi estimation in a nutshell is the principle of using underestimated factors and overestimated factors to find an estimate which is somewhat correct. Now let's say that in the 10 to the 154 trillion possible videos, one in a quadrillion of these videos are actual videos. And then let's say that one in a trillion of these videos are actual good videos. Now one in a trillion of one in a quadrillion may seem like a huge number, but after dividing, we're still left with a good 10 to the 139 trillion combinations of good videos. The average YouTube video is 10 minutes, so if each of these good videos were 10 minutes long, we would be left with 10 to the 139 trillion years of good content. It's weird knowing that this pile of 10 to the 154 trillion possible videos includes the video you're watching right now. It includes all of the videos on your recommended tab, all of your videos in your YouTube history, all of my videos that I've ever uploaded, all the videos that you've possibly ever uploaded, it probably even includes videos that will be uploaded tomorrow and the next day and into the future. It includes all uploads. So, if you want to show the algorithm that this 1 in 10 to the 154 trillion possible video on YouTube is good, you should subscribe right now.